Hello, I'm Mick Green. I've been studying a bird called the ring oozle for many years now in mid Wales. The ring oozle is a small blackbird, one of the thrush family, it's the mountain blackbird. It looks very similar to a blackbird except it has a big white crescent on its, on its chest. This is typical ring oozle habitat. The craggy edges, heather clad where the birds will nest and then down below in the fields where they'll go and forage for worms and, and other insects that they eat and feed their young on. Ring oozles have been declining in Britain for the last 30 years at least, and we don't really know why. The habitat here doesn't appear to have changed. Although it breeds here in Britain, it migrates to the Atlas Mountains in Morocco, where it winters. Last year we managed to track ring oozles on their migration route. We fitted a number of birds in Scotland with a device called a geolocator, which records day length, and you can turn that into latitude and longitude and find out where the bird is travelling. We had to recapture the birds when they came back from Morocco and we only managed to catch one but it gave us very valuable data and shows us that the birds come down from Scotland or from mid Wales down into southern Britain, down through England, across the Channel, down the west of France, down through the middle of Spain and then over the Straits of Gibraltar onto the wintering grounds in Morocco and Tunisia. So we think one of the problems might be on the migration route and that's hopefully the next thing we want to look at. people are interested in the ring oozle, they can go to our website uh, where they can look at more details and they can give us any observations that they have in ring oozles, either in the hills during the breeding season or on migration as they come down through southern Britain. We're really keen to get as many sightings as we can uh, and there's a, there's a button you can click on the website to give us the sightings. We're also obviously looking for donations to carry on the research. Money for ecological research in Britain is very hard to get at the moment so all donations are very welcome. Thank you.